And it's all new tonight. A local deputy shoots a 13 year old girl after she allegedly shot a man in a gated community in Fayette County. Let's get straight to Joe Hinky. Joe joins us live now to walk us through what happened, Joe. We're on. There were at least two children at the scene of the shooting. According to the GBI, this started as a quote custody exchange dispute involving a three year old at a home in Fayetteville and suddenly escalated into a shooting. The incident took place at a home on Carnoustie Way in a gated Fayetteville neighborhood. Information released late Thursday afternoon by the GBI describes a 38-year-old man calling the Fayette County Sheriff's Office shortly before 9 p.m. Wednesday and requesting help with a custody exchange dispute involving a three-year-old. Minutes later, a deputy arrived and met the man at the front of the gated Whitewater Creek subdivision. After a conversation, the pair went to the home on Carnoustie Way. This is when the situation escalated. According to the GBI, the man parked in the driveway and while standing at the front porch, the deputy began walking up to the home. Then a 13-year-old girl, according to investigators, came out of the home and shot multiple times toward the man with the handgun hitting him. This is when the deputy fired multiple times, hitting the teen. She would be taken to Children's Health Care of Atlanta Eggleston. The man was taken to Grady Hospital. Both are expected to survive. And we haven't yet learned what the exact relationship is between the two children and the man that was shot. Now, Ron, you're a former police officer. I'm interested in your perspective here. The situation, we have that teen allegedly coming out of the home, firing at this man, that deputy's walking up on the situation. If you're that deputy, what's going through your mind as you see this play out? You know, when officers go through the academy, I don't care if it's a teenager or if it's an adult. If someone is pointing a weapon at you, a deadly weapon at you, then you're supposed to engage them with deadly force. You're not going to shoot the weapon out of their hands, shoot them in the shin to try to to wound them is deadly force. And so that 13 year old is fortunate to be alive tonight, Joe. And as is the case in a majority of officer involved shootings, the GBI now leading the investigation. So they're probably looking at the mindset of that deputy and going through those different factors that you described. Yeah, that's right.